and that just made us laugh. And so we started sending them in the whole book. That was from that was a response to Margaret Lawrence. Uh, the Stone Angle is a song about a statue in Manitoba. There's no excuse for a man not to try and find himself a good wife. Hagar tried to pass ideology to her son by playing store with him. So I'll read a few. I'll read a few selections of these. Maybe um, I'll start with the. Should we start with Atwood or should we start with Monroe? I mean. Is this an Outward crowd or a Monroe crowd? No, Monroe. Start with Monroe? This is, this is her time, damn it. Uh, absolutely. Alice, so here's just some selections from this. Lives of Girls and Women falls into the genre of Southern Ontario. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually a subcategory of the main genre called real. <laughs> this genre usually addresses the ugly cures for life. <laughs> Monroe's text, Lives of Girls and Women, is about coming in sex and femalehood. Everything in society is unacceptable, especially the sexy. When the text is as ambiguous as its author, we have to assume that we are reading Alice Monroe, and not one of her characters. Throughout her writing, there is strong evidence that Monroe has feelings of her own. 